this blending of these two stories of me riding my horse and riding bareback and jumping the horse, you know, really confident young lady, um, wanting to be a part of the civil rights movement, finding a way to do that, um, finding my voice, speaking out, going from being this shy girl in school to finally being able to speak out and, you know, talk about race on some level in school and, um, and talk about it within the Jack and Jill group. And, um, I just wanted to share that with kids because I think so many kids today are in that same kind of position. You know, where they're receiving negative in images about themselves. Think of all of the immigrant children that come into this country today and how they're told constantly that they're, you know, if they're brown, I'm not talking about necessarily white immigrant children, I'm talking about brown ones, you know, black ones, if they, um, that they're not wanted. Their parents are not wanted. They're illegal. You know, they're uh, go back home kind of thing. And even though they've lived here for so long, how does that how do they get past that those being told this constantly this um, negative self image and be able to blossom as confident young people and so i've just worked tirelessly you know with kids on finding their voice you know through the breaking barriers program through my writing with kids so yes, my story is unique in that you know not everybody has a famous dad and or even someone that or family that's so socially conscious, um, but it can happen to anyone. You know you can get pulled down and you have to pull yourself out of it and blossom. And um, that's what I want kids to know that that if they find their voice and speak out, that it gives them a sense of empowerment, and um, they are not. Um, and therefore, hopefully, they'll be less controlled by forces, external forces that are giving them the ne negative messages, make them feel like they can do anything if they prepare themselves, believe in themselves, speak out, out against injustice, um, and keep moving forward.